YouTubers, this is the first day of the Christmas calendar. We are going to kick off with amazing, amazing party food. Crispy squid with the most amazing spicy mayonnaise. It's a beautiful recipe and you'll blow people away. So let's get our heads around it. What makes the best, not just good, the best crispy squid. We've got some squid. It's been gutted and skinned and your fishmonger will do this for you. We are going to get a nice ninja knife and we're going to go through the body of the squid very gently to the tip. Now we need something really technical. Swing! A regular eating knife. A sharp knife will screw this up. I want you to just lightly score it on the inside of this squid. You don't want to push down, you'll just cut through it. We'll turn it around and we'll do this side. I'm making a little kind of chessboard. So by scoring it, we've already started to tenderize it. Beautiful. But we want to crunch. There's nothing wrong with just straight old flour. It's going to kind of create this lovely outside layer that's going to be your crunch. But that flour, you can infiltrate and you can flavour and you can make the most delicious flour ever. Get a big handful of fennel seeds. Whiz it up. So I've got some oregano going in. It smells and tastes gorgeous. Heap teaspoon of salt to get things going and whiz it up. I'm putting what you can see is a large amount in there. Ground white pepper. A good heaped teaspoon in there. So mix it up with your hands. In we go with the squid. So I want to dress each one of these so it's all covered. Onto the legs. The legs I always cook one minute before the other parts. The legs I think benefit from a good old cooking. There is an optional extra, unwaxed lemon. I want to slice this up, but we want it thin. I'm going to throw that into the flour. And some parsley. What I'm going to do is make sure there's a little bit of water on the parsley and mix it up. I'm going to let that sit for five minutes. To go with it is going to be an amazing mayonnaise. And I want a mayonnaise that when you dip the squid in, it's going to go woohoo! Get a clove of garlic with a good pinch of salt. Let's start the story. Smash into a pulp. Two heaped tablespoons of mayo go in. We mix it. I'm going to take a really amazing product that I love called harissa. This is sometimes a mixture of chilies. I mean, look at it. It's amazing. It is hot, but it's like a rounded, beautiful hot. So I'm going to put one teaspoon in there. Then we need to bring it to life. So I'm going to go in with the juice of half a juicy lemon. So we're lifting that mayonnaise. If you want to get more lemon flavour, the zest is super good. And I want a, like a sea of mayo. There's a secret ingredient that's going to really kick it up. Rose water. It's fragrant, it's floral. Your crispy squid's going to become famous overnight. So we've got the chilli in it, but then we're going to take that harissa and put it on it. And look at the darkness of that chilli oil. And just marvel. So when people go for a little smidgen of crispy squid, they're going to get a beautiful mayonnaise and then punch around the face of just happiness and joy. No mucking about there. Right, let's cook some squid. You probably won't have a thermometer. Grab a potato, put it in, and by the time it floats like this one, you should be rattling around 170 degrees Celsius. So gather your legs, shake off your excess, and in it goes. There's a bit of spitting going on, so you might want to keep your distance. In we go with the squid. All very exciting. Don't overfill your pan. So the legs have had about one and a half minutes. The bodies have had about 40 seconds. Then I'm thinking about my lemons, which will only take 30 seconds. We'll make it look pretty, but they are nice to eat. Look at our lovely crispy skin. It's looking, yeah! In with the parsley. Take this squid that's now done onto your paper. That's going to drain. Look at the color, phenomenal. Absolutely beautiful. Perfectly cooked bodies, most importantly. That's where your money is. At this point, what I like to do is take our little hot friend here, hot and crispy, right? We're going to slice this up, sharp knife to go through. And when you do that, you get that. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is what it's all about. Beautiful, juicy, delicate squid. Rude boy styly crispy on the outside, right? And that is a game changer. Slice through them any thickness that you like. Obviously, that means you can stretch it a little further should more people turn up. Really, really beautiful. Very, very nice. Crispy galore. I mean, look at that, guys. Not many people serve it like this. I think it's exciting. There you go. That's the festive, crispy squid. Amazing crust. Super ridiculous mayonnaise. If you like this recipe, like it. And of course, keep the comments coming in. It's really important to where we go next. And all you have to do now, take a piece of squid and dip into our mayonnaise and then put it in our gob. That is amazing. You've got to have a go at that.
Throughout December, me and the rest of the FoodTube family are giving you brand new videos every single day, full of great recipes, tips, and festive fun. So get involved, subscribe to FoodTube, it's free, and together we'll make it the best Christmas ever. Lots of love, Mr. O. Word up, FoodTubers! Come on!